Ukrainian intelligence details the equipment it says Moscow is arming North Korean troops with, from Dragonov sniper rifles to thermal imagers. This post received a score of 7,000, with an upvote ratio of 97%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Kim Jong is in the Mussolini role. No one will take him seriously 100 years from now like the actual Mussolini. He's a joke. Also supplied them with canned dog meat for rations. Not joking. Most the equipment the NK soldiers are supplied with originated from Russia and with that supply chain, they are doomed to fail. Came here to say, they might have a nice sniper rifle. But that rifle only works if the guys have food and water. Sniper rifles also require a bit of upkeep and calibration, but I'm sure that has been done religiously. S. At least they aren't getting issued Mosin Nagants like the Donetsk forces. You just don't appreciate the Easter discs of aged wood grain. I own a few too many Mosin Nagants and I love shooting them, but I'd hate to have to fight a modern war using them. And I have no doubt that yours are better maintained than theirs by a wide margin. How do you know these Incares aren't using the oily residue that floats on top in cans of dog food as barrel grease? You misunderstood. It's canned dog, not canned dog food. People are stupid to write off the NK troops as mere cannon fodder. Ukraine will lose more lives fighting them, even if they are not particularly well trained. It's not trivial at all. Putin won't want to use them as cannon fodder either. He needs a lot more than 10,000 troops in the long run. Sending these into the meat grinder isn't likely to get him that. Spending troops doesn't have to equal wasting troops. Classic example, recon by fire. Send prisoners or North Koreans forward, observe where and when they get shot at. Figure out where that fire is coming from, suppress with artillery and assault with trained veterans. It's expensive and slow, but it does work. This is a good video of the current situation with some insight into the front. They talk a bit about recon motorbikes that do what you're describing, and it's working. I didn't know in-depth analysis like this was available. Thank you for sharing the link. There's some really good analysis that's available out there. I highly recommend the YouTube channel Perrin to get a better grasp on the defense procurement side of things. He is well informed with defense economics, procurement, logistics and their its practical usage on the battlefield, and applies a lot of nuance on the realities of the war where a lot of news media falls short. Ukraine intelligence seems to be suggesting that North Korean troops will be part of their sniper squads. If true, this is even more nefarious than simply added ground troops. North Korea may have deliberately sent some of their elite military snipers to help the Russian military. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.